Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This video is the second part of a two-part series on my channel about organizing my stationery. So as you can see, I have here my old stationery box. My new one is there and it's empty. Uh, but when this video goes live, I already moved all of my pens to my new stationery box. So if you're interested in that, please watch the first part of this series. It's going to be linked in the cards and here in the description. In this video, I'm just going to take all of my pens out of my box and I'm going to create a journal for my pen swatches. So basically, I'm going to swatch every single pen that I have. And it sounds insane, but in the long term it's going to be a lifesaver because I actually like to see all of the pens that I have and when I think about a theme or I'm looking for that certain color, I like to just know what pen it is. So every time that I receive new pens, I swatch them out on some notebook and I post it on Instagram. But now I'm going to swatch every single pen that I received in a specific journal and every time that I receive new pens I'm going to just swatch it in that journal. This is a lifesaver because every time that I need to do a theme or to search for that color I know exactly what that color is just by flipping through my swatches notebook. This idea of creating a journal with all of my pen swatches was inspired by Justine Bujo here on YouTube. I believe I'm going to leave her channel down below. Uh, in one of her videos about pen pals uh, she showed a notebook where she had a lot of swatches and I got the idea of doing the same thing. I recently did my February theme and it's pink so I had to swatch every single pink pen that I had and it's just a waste of ink and time and if I just have a journal with all of my swatches I just need to flip it through, see the pink that I want and use that pen and it's that easy. The notebook that I'm going to use is going to be this notebook by Notebook Therapy. This is one of the set of four Tsuki notebooks by Notebook Therapy. They sent me this notebook for free and I haven't talked about it on my channel, but I received them. I think they are um, really great for note taking or to journal or to just brain down. So this is going to be my notebook for my pen swatches. I just did a um, really simple and doodly cover page. And then I'm going to have an index right here. The pages are not filled in yet because obviously I haven't um, done anything. I just sketched where all the brands are going to be because I'm going to organize this notebook by brands. Instead of organizing by color, I prefer to organize by brands because every time that I receive a new pack of like 50 or 100 pens, I don't need to go to every single page of color category and swatch the pens because some pens are like greenish, bluish and you kind of like is this blue or is this green? So I prefer to divide the notebook into category and brand. So I'm going to have a fine liner category, a calligraphy pen category and then I'm going to have all the brands that I currently have. This is going to be the page for my Tombow Dual Brush pens. I'm just going to write the title. Um, at the top of the pages and then I'm going to swatch them on the pages and I have this for uh, like zebra mild liners and milk liners and highlighters and everything. I have this for my Crayola Super Tips pack of 50. I'm really excited so I'm going to take every single pen from my stationery box and organize it by brand so I can start swatching. Thank you. 
So I just filmed the two videos. I have my stationery box here next to me. If you haven't watched the first part of this series, I'm going to link it in the description and in the cards. Again, watch that video before you watch this one because this is like in the middle of the day and the other one is like the whole thing. I organized everything and I showed you in that video. And now I'm just going to share with you how many pens I swatched. I made the math and I swatched 296 pens today. So yeah, I can confidently say that I swatched today 296 pens and that I have more than 300 pens. Let me know in the comments if you have another video ideas or stationary related ideas because I love making videos about stationery. They are really important in the bullet journal community, so if you have any ideas of videos, let me know. So I hope you like this video. Give it a like if you enjoy it, subscribe to my channel to support my work, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!